Hey, man. You trying to build some muscle? Yeah? That's good. That's real good. You just found one of the best fitness channels on YouTube. Shut up. Ow! Ow! Fuck out the way. What's up, everybody? Give me some room. Give me some room. In the shot. And get the fuck up off me. Get some scan back at you. What am I doing wrong on hitting chest? Call them games. See that? All that separation. I've been eating like an asshole. Yeah, look at that. See that separation? It's a line right there. Look at that. It's games. Hey guys, I'm 17. I've been working out for about a month now, but I can't seem to hit my chest properly. Fucking youngster. 17, been working out a month? Yeah. You what we call a newbie. <clears throat> Youngster, but man. this problem is a common problem. That's the only reason why I'm doing this. Yeah, I do dumbbell even if you ain't 17. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker, 30 years old doing this shit in the gym. <laughs> See it all the time. I do dumbbell bench press, flat bench, and cable crossover, but it always works my shoulders and arms more. My chest hardly aches afterwards. Man, what do he say? Flat? He does dumbbell and cable bench. crossovers and, and flat bench press and cable crossover. My my chest hardly aches afterwards. I Try increasing the weight to 18 kilograms, whatever the fuck that is. I, I work on pounds. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be out there in uh, like the UK and shit. But anyway, I'm not gonna hold it against you. Yeah. I try increasing the weight to 18 kilograms on a dumbbell press and I keep it at four sets of 10, but I keep getting the same effect. Yeah. Your advice would be great. Thanks, guys. Will from England, see? From England, huh? From England. Anyway. What's his name? His name's Will. Will with one L or two? Two L's. What kind of whip? Shut the hell up. I seen motherfuckers named Will got one L. And for some reason, they have an E on the end. I was like, what the fuck is the E for? Yeah. But whatever. See, this is a common problem. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Me but personally, I think you're doing... Your, the exercise you've, you've picked out, you select, I think they're wrong, man. Shouldn't be doing those. Well. I mean, dumbbell bench is, uh... He said dumbbell flat. Yeah. I mean, dumbbell flat, I mean, it's not wrong to exercise if you're yeah. doing it properly. The optimal way to train your chest is the decline and the incline, but... Yeah. That's the best two exercises for your chest yeah. if you want to... Not cable crossovers. Yeah, and they're not cable crossovers, yeah. neither. But anyway, this is the thing. The reason why you feel it more on your shoulders, you're lifting too fucking heavy. Yeah. Okay? And your form's fucked up. Yeah, you're probably flaring out your elbow. This is the thing. Let me get some scan back action. Get some more scan back action. See, this is the thing, man. You probably, when you're doing bench, whether it's dumbbells or barbell, whatever the hell you're doing, your elbows probably flared out like this. Yeah. That's what you're doing. Your elbows are flared the fuck out. And hey, you're going to snap all this shit up right here. Yeah, you put a lot you of feel all that pressure and strain right here in the on shoulder. your shoulders, which is common if you, cause you do know, this ain't nothing but shoulders and triceps. Yeah, get them damn uh, elbows down, man. Right, this is what you gotta do. Your yeah. elbows gotta be close down by your sides. Yeah, see, look at that. Look how that chest getting activated. Yeah, mm. see them gains. Look at that. This is what it look like when I'm bitching. Mm. See? Yeah. Gotta have the elbows down by your side. Not flare the fuck up here like that. Yeah. Gotta have them down Gotta by your side. Gotta keep them damn elbows down, man. Get the fuck off me. Man, get them damn sweat ass arms <laughs> off me, man. Like that. Right? Have a little arch in your back. Drop the barbell right at the bottom of your chest. Yeah. Elbows down to your side. Yeah. See how the chest is getting activated? You see it? Look at that. Hey, man. See, like this. No activation. Yeah. Hey, man. You really need... To make your primary chest movement, this is just our opinion, is to decline dumbbell or barbell. That is your primary movement. And then do dumbbell on the incline or the barbell. Yeah. And if you want, do the cable crossovers at the end as a finish. Yeah. But that's not a big mass builder. Your mass builder yeah. is those compound moves. And your rep range is great. 10 reps. Yeah. That's great rep range. I'm telling you, man. Drop the weight down. See, you're stronger when you lift like this. Yeah. You can move more weight. But yeah. your form is fucked up and your chest not getting activated. Yeah. Drop the weight down. Yeah. And, and do it this way. Man, get your, the fuck off me. With your arms down by your sides, it's going to activate all this. And it's, all them pecs. Yeah, it's been a lot of dudes, man, that did a bunch of uh, flat bench press. 
They got some big ass arms, but no chest, man. Look at you all know? that goddamn separation up in that bitch. I'm telling you, man. Switch to the decline, barbell or dumbbell, okay? Then the incline, barbell or dumbbell. And then if you want, you can go in and do some of them bitch overs at the end, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But you need to do the right exercise. If you want a big chest, decline and incline, man. Hey, that's our take on that side bife. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, man. Side bife. Good luck to your chest gains. Yeah. But it's just advice. Do it for all. What do you want to do? Hunch twins, bitches.